Hey, Ken, thanks for sending in your driver swing to us here at CoachMyVideo.com. Uh, love the nighttime driving range scene. I wish it was warm enough here in Colorado to be hitting balls at night. Uh, looks cool, very dramatic. Uh, Hollywood set, almost. Uh, I took a look at your driver swing from behind, and I have you queued up here uh, from face on, and uh, it looks to me like you absolutely kill it. Um, I don't know if you're in a long drive contest or something like that, but man, it looks like you have a big athletic swing. Now, if we take a look here at your setup, uh, your width of your stance is pretty wide. It's a fair bit outside your shoulders. That's a little bit bigger than, uh, than normal or than standard. But again, like I said, it looks like you kill it, and that's pretty typical of people that just beat the crap out of the ball. So as we take this uh, swing back a little bit, again, I have a little concern here. We see how much you've moved off of the ball, and by off of the ball, I mean your body has moved this direction away from the target line. That means you're setting up your weight pretty good in that right side, again, to deliver a massive blow to the ball, I'm sure. And look, you continue to go back even farther than where I was before. So if I go back in here and grab a line and just put a draw, drop a line down through you here, you're, you've maintained your weight inside those feet, which is, uh, which is good. But remember, we talked about how wide your stance was to begin with. So there's been a fair bit of lateral move. If I go back now, go back to where you started at your address position, and I put those lines back in, you can see you have slid from here over to this is the line. This is the line, of course, that I put in before about your, uh, your feet. So your body, your body center has moved from about here over to here. That's a fair bit of lateral slide that you're going to have to make up as you go forward in the swing. But you load into that side good. Like I said, there you are at the top of the swing and then there's that forward move again. And then bang, hitting through. So uh, from what I can tell, Ken, you all need my advice uh, other than to say you know, if you want to control the ball a little bit better, instead of just ripping it, you might narrow the stance just a hair, maybe, you know, like half a foot or something like that, and try to control the lateral movement in your swing so that you're staying more over the ball and not backing away from it. So you're not moving away this way and then having to come back again significantly when you hit it. That just makes for a slightly uh, less consistent swing. And, you know, it takes a lot of practice to time that well, uh, moving back off the ball and everything. But... Uh, you got a good rock solid golf swing. Looks like you hit the ball a mile, like I said, and uh, I wouldn't change much other than to try and control that lateral slide. So thanks for sending that golf swing in, and uh, hope you're keeping the people of Pleasanton uh, on the straight and narrow. Thanks again for sending in the video to CoachMyVideo.com.